Heissan, heissan. Hi. <laughs> ah, somebody's there already. Hello. <laughs> yeah. Naomi decided to come to say hello for you guys in the beginning of this chat. How are you doing? Greetings from Spain. <laughs> yeah, hey, hey. Hey, babies. Somebody say hi. <laughs> hola, hermosas. Hola, hola. ¿Cómo están? Naomi started her school a few days ago. Oh, well, last week, right? Yeah. Last week. Already the summer holidays are over. So we are going back to the routine here. Mommy working and she's working. You're working too, right? Yep, in the sixth grade. <laughs> sixth grade already, oh my God. Where all the time went. Hmm. Colombia, somebody from Colombia. Hey, wow, so, wow. Brazil, Argentina, look. Hmm. Patagonia, wow. Does Naomi speak Spanish? Yes, I do. Ah, uh, sí. Si. O oh, como? <laughs> si. Si, si. And Finnish as well. Three languages. Hmm. Mexico, mira. So many. Latin American countries, Central American countries. Hey. Somebody's again asking. Hmm. Naomi habla español? Si. Si. <laughs> All right. Good luck for your school, Naomi. You read that? Yeah. Hmm. So thank you for joining me today here. It's been a while, I know. I'm sorry. Uh, you know, I'm being a busy mommy. Busy mommy and busy artist. And I had a really, really big pleasure to do some shows. During this summer, it was really nice, really, really nice to get back on the road. And uh, there are lots of news, news to share with you, and more to come, even. Uh, nice things happening. Life is getting back to normal, hopefully. That's what we're looking for, yeah? Hmm. <laughs> All right, you can go if you want to do something. Okay. Epa. Epa. <laughs> so look what I have here. I have uh, this beauty. I have uh, this beauty. I have this beauty. And I have this beauty. And then I have this beauty. Land of sea and sun. I love these little tiny vinyls. I loved working on them. I loved working on the artworks and all uh, the design and everything. Really lovely. Have you noticed something weird about them though? They kind of belong together. If you are a collector and you get them all, you can kind of lay them out and see, oh, they belong together. But of course, um, there will be complete album also one day after all these songs been released. Next single from Outlanders will be coming in in January, long time, but yeah, in January, and there will be eight singles altogether plus four more songs, and then an album, you know, complete album. So, have you liked our last song, Land of Sea and Sun, with Marty Friedman? He did a, such a great job with it. I really love, love the way he played on this song. Uh, surprisingly beautiful, really, really unbelievable work from him. <laughs> but it's, it's so nice. Um, I've been reading your comments and it has been so lovely how, how well you have received this project. I mean, it's such a different project whatsoever I've done in my life before electronic music, guitars, my voice. 
I'm even so I'm even singing differently on this project. So it's been a very nice um, experiment, sort of to say, but uh, with 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 a friend of mine, with Torsten, and with with you know, it's great to work with a person that you love as a friend, and you know, like oh, and magic happens. So I'm really happy that that you've been receiving these songs well, and you've enjoyed it. Uh, I have. It's a good um, balance between my rock uh, and classical projects. Mm. Hola, ¿cómo estás? Somebody's asking how I am doing. I'm doing good, thank you. I'm really, really okay. Summer is here still in Spain. We have a really, really warm day still, like really boiling. It's, it's kind of really like a summer. It's not autumn yet. Um, and uh, I'm working, I'm writing songs and preparing for concerts and practicing and oi oi oi, many things, many things at the same time. But you know me. If you know anything about me, you know that I'm always working several things at the same time. How was your summer? Yeah. Oh yeah, great. All right, what I needed to tell you, <laughs> I have a list here. Hey, yeah, that on a 23rd of September, there will be a vinyl release of my very first single, I Walk Alone. 15 years have passed by. Lord have mercy. I mean, really 15 years since I took those first steps with my own music. Oh, wow. But this vinyl will be white, 10-inch uh, ten, ten vinyl, really, and limited, and like a really beautiful white one. And so, and it has uh, very nice versions of I Walk, I Walk Alone, some remixes and stuff like that. I think even a demo, if I remember correctly. But um, yeah, it's very nice to kind of refresh the memories and go back back in time with this re re-release let's say even though as a vinyl the single has never been available before <laughs> Mexico hola Mexico wow were you ever scared somebody's saying Hoof, how many times I've been how many times I've been scared in my life? <laughs> so many times. I have a phobia also. I have arachnophobia. I hate spiders. Well, actually, mm, I'm getting better with that. Because, you know, we are kind of living here in a countryside. And um, there are all kind of crawling creatures crawling into my house every, every day. So I'm kind of getting used to have all these creepy creatures around. So, but anything with more than two legs is too much for me to handle. <laughs> I, I just cannot. Hairy, even worse. So, <laughs> so no, no. Ah, these, somebody's Angelinos Aros. Hey, I really love the, these. They are, they are like a light as a feather, these um, earrings. They are from Weissen and Design, a Finnish company. I started working with them, promoting them a little bit. And uh, if you have noticed, maybe in the past, you've seen me uh, sending messages about that there is a Tarja 10 discount code for their web shop and actually that discount code is still valid so we'll get like 10 percent discount of all the jewelry if you want to buy something from their web shop i hope that we can come up with a bigger plan with uh, with the company in the future so you might see these kind of things or other things coming out but it's a very nice Absolutely high quality product. And these are like really so light. I love them. And they really look like me. <laughs> I like them. 
do they ship worldwide? Yeah, for sure they ship worldwide. Hmm. Qual is tu comida favorita? Somebody is asking my favorite food. Hey, that is quite tough. Well, I am still a meat eater, but I eat red meat like quite rarely. And I um, I really love a great steak. I, I have to, I have to. Like I got kind of, I never ate a lot of meat before moving down to Argentina. And it took me many years to really learn to eat meat. Um, but then once I started, I could never stop. <laughs> So it was like that. Mm. <laughs> arepas. Yeah, I love arepas. Actually, my my friend a um, few months ago made me arepas. I really love them. They're delicious. Can I see your tattoo? Yeah, you can see my tattoo. It's still, it's still here, you know. I... I should go down to Argentina to to maybe rework a little bit. I have a plan maybe making a whole arm. But I need to, I don't know. Because I need to keep myself strong, as you can see, strong. I'm working out, I'm working out, I'm working out like crazy here. Because the tour is coming. The tour, the raw tour, finally absolutely fantastic i can't wait raw tour is happening after all this uh after all this time of postponing and cancelling and shit i mean it's happening in october um i will be back on the road oh in my beautiful nightliner and uh with my crew and musicians and oh my god can't wait and with you people so Eastern European countries this time in October. Please check the dates from my web page. Um, also, during that tour, I will do the VIPs and meet and greets and all that kind of things that I'm used to do, you know, already in the past. So we will start that again. Those kind of things are also available in the web, web store. Actually, there is like web store section in my web page. So you will see all that. Uh, yeah, can't wait really to meet up with you and can't really wait to feel you again. And I, my own shows. Oh. It's, uh, it's been so nice to plan them, the set list and um, the songs that we're going to be playing. And hmm, I need to get back to play piano again. Oh my lord. Good reminder. <laughs> I'm talking out loud. I need to start practicing playing because I'm playing piano, but I'm writing songs and I'm just like bullshitting. I'm not really like uh, practicing piano playing any longer. I used to do that a lot. I mean, hey, I used to play very well piano in the past uh, when I was young. When I was young, that was long ago. <laughs> yeah. Lovely, lovely people, lovely comments. Sorry, I pause here because I'm reading your comments. Marry me. Sorry, marry me. Sorry. Next life. <laughs> I would love to sing a goodbye stranger with Christina one day. Hopefully that could happen. One day. It will. Your favorite wine. I'm a wine girl. Yeah. How can you know? How How did you know that? Well, I've been all the time posting shit in the wine class. Ching, ching. Keep peace. Well, of course I love wine. But usually, nowadays, I'm, I'm drinking um, organic wine. Because I started to get like a... I have been suffering headaches before as well. But I never really related to... I've never been a heavy drinker, right? But... um even after one glass of red wine, if it happens to be a bad red, um, I started to get headaches. So organic wine is better for me. I love the white and I love the red. Um, white, you know, very, very warm summer day. There is nothing better than a really good white wine. 
and red wine, red wine with a great steak. Yeah. Orland Islands. Hey, wow. Hello, Orland. Ah. <laughs> wow. Cuando vas a cantar en Teatro Colón? When are you gonna sing in Teatro Colón? It's a beautiful, beautiful, the most important opera theater in Argentina. It's located in Buenos Aires, a very famous opera house. I would love to. It would be a dream of mine as well. If it's yours, it's it's mine as well. There have been some talks. There have been some talks about it already for some years. But let's see. Let's see um, if they would have me there. It would be an honor one day. What I am checking my list here. <laughs> um, Barcelona, yeah. Hey, there will be a show next year in Barcelona. Somebody was saying that uh, luckily saw me in Fuengirola, but yeah, I'm coming back to Barcelona. Next year, Roar Tour will continue in Europe. Hey, so many nice people. <laughs> You're so cool. Do you like English breakfast? I like every kind of breakfast almost. Because it's like um, I have to eat in the mornings. I won't... I mean, I exercise every morning. Today in the morning I went to swim. I did not have any breakfast. I just had a espresso in the morning and I left and I lots of water I go to the swimming pool because I used to go also to the ocean but mm, when it's a little bit wavy day it's like mm, I start to get seasick so I went to the swimming pool and I swim like interval training and I swim a long distance training so after that when I'm finished I'm totally kaput and finished oh, a good breakfast oh my it feels so good. So I kind of feel like I like to exercise before the great breakfast and then I eat like a horse. <laughs> I like a lot. <laughs> Indonesia. I would love to go to Indonesia again. Thank you. That was wonderful. Jakarta. I love that show. Um, it was a festival I performed a few years ago in Jakarta. Oh, I loved it. I would love to go back there. And so many other places, guys. Now you start telling me, oh, please come. I would love to. I need to call out all the promoters in the world to bring me over. Mm. <laughs> Estás casada. Separate. No, no voy a separar. ¿Cómo que voy a separar? Sí, casada. Casada hace 20 años, ¿eh? Ya desde hace 20 años estoy casada. Oh, yeah. This year we are gonna, at the end of the year, New Year's Eve, me and Marcelo, we are gonna get, be married 20 years. 20? Are you kidding me? 20 years with the same guy. How is this even possible? <laughs> really? 20 years married. Oh, I'm crying already. Mm, yeah, so it's a huge party. New Year. Who is coming? We should celebrate. Mm. Uh, yep. <laughs> Tarja Turunen Suomi is hey there. Hey, hey. Hey, did on it? Hey, my friend Heidi is there too. Oh my God. Mwah, 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 mwah. Ihana. Huh. Wow. Congratulations. Somebody else is also having a wedding day. 20 years this year. Absolutely. How can we? <laughs> so many tasks. Well, I hope there will be some shows in Finland very soon. We're working on it. We're working on it. 
Oh, wow. Another person also 20 years married. Oh, wow. Well, we are, we are lucky girls. We have found a man, you know. It's not very easy, though. <laughs> Christmas special this year. Will you do a Christmas special this year? Of course. Hey, you know me. I'm always on the road during Christmas time. So this year also there will be a long Christmas tour. I mean, a long one, a month long do throughout Europe. So you need to check the dates from my webpage because it's like a lot of shows and uh, Christmas shows. Really beautiful. They, these shows are different, very different from what, what I normally do. You know, well, I do Christmas shows every, every end of the year, but hey, from the rock shows, at least they are very different. <laughs> somebody, <laughs> somebody was saying that. Hey, you got married, and I was barely born. Yeah. Mm. See all these wrinkles. I'm old. Hey, forty-five. How is that? How is that even possible? I haven't still, you know, gotten any kind of life uh, crisis or age crisis so far, but come on. It's uh, it's uh, age. Hmm. <laughs> Ukraine loves you. Oh, I love Ukraine and I miss my fans in Ukraine and I miss all the people. I miss all the cities, the beautiful cities and places I got to visit as an artist. I really hope to come back to your beautiful country one day. I really hope that. I pray for that. <laughs> Ihana! There are so young people also listening here. Hey! Wow! So beautiful. <laughs> Not wrinkles, just happy lines. Hmm. I'm a very happy person. At least I try to be a positive person. Hmm. Yep. <laughs> I was just uh, checking about this uh, web shop situation because I put here a reminder to tell you that my web shop usually nowadays is in Europe because it used to be in UK and uh, well now at the moment currently is in Europe so you will if you find something interesting there you won't need to pay any if you live in Europe I mean <laughs> if you live in Europe you won't pay any taxes or customs and so it's kind of easier at the moment Do you like Czech Republic? Well, I've loved Czech Republic. Czech Republic. Czech Republic. I cannot speak any longer. Yeah, I love. And uh, you will see me performing there in October. Huh? Rock shows in Brno and Pardovice. Yay! I'm so happy. And um, then later on, of course, later on in the year, also during the Christmas time. So. Czech Republic has embraced me as an artist. It's been amazing to perform there so many times already. It's becoming a tradition to go to see you and sing for you, even in a Christmas time. Thank you for that. <laughs> hi from Las Vegas. Hey, hi there, far away Las Vegas. Wow. <laughs> I love reading you. Sorry, I'm like, a, I'm like an idiot here looking and reading you. <laughs> when did you learn to speak Spanish? Well, I... Uh, maybe some of you might know about this, but when I was young, <laughs> I used to live in Germany a few years. I was studying there in a music university. And uh, at that time, I met Marcelo. I fell in love. And uh, I thought that... Mm, I should know some of Spanish. I mean, come on, I have a boyfriend in the other on the other side of the globe and I have no whatsoever idea about Spanish. So I went to the Open University in Karlsruhe and I studied, I learned the basics of Spanish in German. Ha, ha. <laughs> 
So like, uh. thinking in Finnish, trying to, you know. But hey, that was only the basics. And then you know, I learned Spanish just by listening to local people, Argentinians. And then one day I just said, okay, I need to start speaking because otherwise I will never begin. And then it was like, uh, it took a long time. And I'm still doing errors, but I don't care any longer. In the beginning, it was like I was so ashamed that, hey, but the locals, they were really supportive and they loved that I, at least I tried. And so I got encouraged by the people, by the Argentinians, beautiful people. Yeah. What do you think about Portuguese? Uh, I actually I like singing in other languages. I'm not good in any of them, but hey, I like I like singing. As a classical singer, you know, we all classical singers, we must must know the phonetics. We need to know. We need to sing in many languages. So I'm kind of used to singing many languages. I like it. Portuguese is very beautiful, very difficult, very. Difficult. But I have had some tryouts, I think. Yeah, even in Brazil, I was singing in my live show a song in Portuguese. Oh. Why you don't live in Brazil? <sighs> I live nowadays in Spain. <laughs> my family is here. My life is here. Oh. What's your next project? Outlanders will continue releasing singles. Um, still quite a few. We have done five so far. There will be eight altogether, plus four songs. So 12 altogether. The whole album will consist 12 songs. That will be releasing, you know, Outlanders will be releasing in a couple of months every now and then. Songs, new songs. With the visual, visualizers you've seen us doing and all that. And then, of course, I am uh, working on the rock album. And you will actually very soon get to hear more news about releases. Because there are plenty of releases coming out very soon. But I can't really give you any further information about them yet. Because we haven't, you know, decided that, that when these news can come out date yet. So, um, but yeah, everything is cooking, let's say. Lots of tours to do, as you, you know, things have not been easy for us artists in the last couple of years. So... I will be doing a lot of raw tours now and still promoting my latest album, even though it's already been there for three years. It's unbelievable. I used to release albums every three years, but now I have a lot of tours to do and uh, the lack of time is killing me. But, you know, I'm along, along the way, I'm preparing a new album all the time. And so, and uh, Christmas album and uh, and uh, and uh, many things. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah, very very soon. People love me. You love the word soon, right? <laughs> yeah. Soon. It's my favorite word. Um, I'm checking my list, what I needed to, like, something that was supposed to be very important to tell you, that if I missed something, not really. Hmm. Not really. I've been bullshitting with you already 30 minutes. <laughs> Uh, 
I have a Christmas song with Dee Snyder. Never happened. Somebody was asking about that. Yeah, really. It was supposed to happen, but it didn't. It didn't. <laughs> you tried to study at the same time listening my life. Oh my God. Go to study. This is not important. Go. Terveisiä Suomesta ja Kuopiosta. No moi, Niko. Moi. Terveiset takaisin. Onko siellä jo kylmä? Here is really warm and beautiful still. Andalusia. But we have this uh, Kalima sand still in the air. Like you barely see the sea or the mountain. You know, there, there are days that it's really shady and gray the day. Unbelievable. I need to clean the terraces every day on the from the house. <laughs> it's really... I washed the car a few days ago. Great. Next morning I woke up and it was the same as before washing, so. Mm. <laughs> Pohjois Karjala, moro! Moi! Voi, kenellä oli syntymäpäivät, kenellä oli synttärit, mutta onnea kovasti. Happy birthday! What about an acoustic tour and album? Hmm. Well, let's say that these Christmas concerts that I'm doing at the end of the year, they are pretty much sort of acoustic from their vibe, you know. This year I will be performing with Julian. Julian comes from Argentina, he plays the guitars. And... Um, Guillermo in keyboards, then Max plays cello, and then it's only me singing, so only four of us. And we play in theaters, we play in churches, and um, atmosphere is really different. Beautiful, very relaxing, moody, nice. Somebody loves my song Dark Star. It's her favorite. Yeah, I, I really like I really like that song as well. So, you know, I have plenty of albums already. I've done plenty of albums, plenty of songs, written many songs. And then, you know, now that I've been preparing the best stuff and all that kind of things. So, um, I heard the song again after not been listening the song for a long time. And I'm like, huh. It's really heavy, rocking, cool. I like it, and me too. I need to get him back to the set list. That's a good vibe. Mm. You know what is very interesting when I'm reading your comments that so many people like different kinds of songs of mine. That is the reality. There is not only one single song that everybody likes or loves. Um, there can be a song that somebody says, Oh, I really don't like that song. Or somebody's like, Oh my God, that's the most important song in my life. Yeah, it is like that. Music is like that. And that's about myself also, how music makes me still very passionate about it. Because it's like, it's such a, it's music is filled with emotions and I work with emotions. I can't do anything, basically anything on the um, surface. Uh, I can't be superficial, sort of. I, I really need to dig deeper every time in my lyrics and even in the music. I need to feel it. If it doesn't move me, I trash it. I, I can't. So when I sing also, I need to vibrate and you need to be able to receive those vibrations. Otherwise it won't work. I believe that who has ever seen me sing in life knows that. I can't fake it. 
it's 100% on nothing. Is it, uh, yeah, somebody is asking about the Christmas record that if it's going to be the second part for the dark Christmas. No, well, yes, it will be. I can tell you that. But how is going to be? <laughs> <laughs> that I can't tell you. <laughs> but again, it's like crazy working in the summertime in the Christmas songs. Yeah, with the Christmas songs. Okay, maybe I bore you already. I will leave you. <laughs> but, yeah. Next, in a couple of weeks time, you will see me touring. Raw tour will start again in Europe. Yeah. And uh, so check out the dates. All should be at the web page, hopefully. And, um, and, and, uh, so, can't wait to get back on the road again with you people. Oh, I love it. And, 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 and so I really hope that you all stay safe and healthy and happy and, and everything. You know, I pour all the positive energy there to you. But thank you again for being there and uh, <laughs> Tari, Tari, Tari don't leave us. Who is calling me Tari? Not many people are calling me Tari. Tari, who is calling me Tari? Also, Doug Wimpy is calling me Tari. Doug, Doug is saying me Tari, Tari don't leave us. Mm. That's so funny. Uh, my nickname some time ago, long time ago, was Tape. I'm still using it in my somewhere. Taape. Taape. But Tari. <laughs> it's good. Yeah. Yeah. I like it. I don't mind. Tarha. Tarja. Taja. I don't care. <laughs> I receive all your love and your messages. Thank you so much for being there. And um, hey, talk to you soon. Um, see you soon and listen to this. Take care. I love you. Have a great, great evening. Greetings.